Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to boost FPS and reduce input delay in Fortnite Chapter 5, and how to get zero ping and fix packet loss in Fortnite. So make sure hit that subscribe button, let's dive into the video. First go to my website, I give link in description, download the FS boost pack from here, and follow me for settings. Running all FPS boost commands is crucial for enhancing overall system performance. These commands are designed to optimize settings and resources for better FPS. Running all FPS boost registry tweaks is essential for fine-tuning system settings. These tweaks aim to optimize the registry for improved performance. Run the registry tweak according to your RAM size. I'm using the 16GB RAM, so I will run 16GB tweak. This will optimize its settings specific to your system configuration. Run the registry tweak of high priority to prioritize the Fortnite process at a high level. This tweak allocates more system resources to Fortnite, enhancing its performance. Execute the filter key center tool and adhere to the instructions to minimize input delay. This process is essential for enhancing responsiveness, particularly during gaming. By reducing input delay, you contribute to better overall system performance and a notable boost. As a next step guys, I'm gonna recommend you the GI Booster, which you can try it for absolutely with free. With the link in description, just make sure that you launch the tool and select Fortnite, and it's gonna automatically find for you the best DNS server in your near for the least amount of latency. As you can see, I only get 11 milliseconds latency, which is giving me already a huge improvement of over 100%. I've been using this for any game switch. I'm playing here right now on my PC. And the best part about it is, it's also searching actively in the background. While you're actually playing for the best DNS servers, it's consistently also showing you the connection between your PC and the router and the router and the actual game server. So therefore, as mentioned, make sure you check it out with the link in description. Go first of all into a Search window. bar and type in a registry enter. Can right click onto it and rendered as administrator. And once in, you know guys, you're going to paste in exactly the following link, which is in the video description. It's basically a line here directly for a registry. Just simply put it then in. Then press enter. And you should find here a perimeter section guys. And you know, we have a bunch of values. And what are we gonna focus on is guys? Is this one here. Keyboard data. Q size this one. You're going to double click on and usually the standard value for ton of you is going to be around 256. Keep in mind that this process is super hard vita. Manning and anything below 100 is where you really notice a difference. So therefore, what I would recommend you is try to go as low as possible, but do it step by step too. If you run into any issues, for me it was, I first of all started with 90, then I went down to something like 75, and finally I figured out 50, Brooks the best on my specific system. But also keep in mind I have a pretty good gaming PC. So therefore, what I would recommend you is go down in like 5 to 10 steps and really try it out again. This is pretty hot Vitaminic. But the lower you can go beneath 100, the less delay you actually going to have on your keyboard. So therefore, it's worth it to try this out. So guys and next Once time, we are here in a registry editor, you can all be seen that I have a following path. You open and I want you to go basically here. First of all, under H key, local machine. Then you gonna go in the system control. Then scroll down a little bit more until you can actually find session manager in here. We're going to scroll down until we find memory management. And there we have now prefect perimeters. We're going to click onto it. So it's basically selected. And in here, now we have enable prefect. We're going to double click onto and it. And you know, you're going to make sure put to put your standard value data of free all the way down to zero and keep it on high Saturday symbol. That way we can disable the prefect and therefore have a way better system responsibility. Now restart your PC to apply the changes. For optimal performance in an FPS boost, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video.